Hi guys, um, I'm going to show you guys how to run Backtracker 5 on your Mac OX. Um, basically, the thing that you'll need is VirtualBox and the ISO for Backtracker. So I have both of them in the link of the description. Um, so first off, you'll need to open this. It will probably have a whole bunch of text and nothing here. So I you have to do is click new. I'll put the name I'll click this. And the type will have to be Linux since you can use Linux and Linux uses backtracker. And sixty for boot. Um I'm using backtracker i3 but it will work for backtracker five also. You know. Um above backtracker five will work. Um it is used for around here won't be that bad. I just create a virtual hard drive. Um wait a sec, I need to see something. Hold on. I need to see something real quick. Yep. Yeah, because it's like this is gonna take a lot of GB and like since I have a whole bunch of stuff. I really don't want giving me an error that I can't use it because I don't have space. I really won't say that. I will just say the preferences won't work. Now this is the most important part. Not really. I uh, just click this folder, and this is where we're gonna put XA the backtracker data. So that is just where you can put. It. Really, that's the only thing it does. So I say backtrack of I made a special folder. You don't have to worry about this, it's just something I put in the folder and you just put a name and hit save. Now this is gonna pop up. Now this is the most important part. If not, it will say there's not enough memory and I don't think you can change this after. So to run this you do have to have at least some GB. This is gonna take away lots of GB. I think this is. I don't know which computer has this. It's weird. TB. I wish my computer had that much. I wish we would be laughing. Uh. You 30, and I'm gonna get that to 20, so. Yeah. 37 too. GB. Make sure it's 30. It could be 25, but just to, like, not risk it that it was 30 I'm just going 30 to about 72 GB um okay continue now it will be powered off before you even turn it on click settings go display put the, ah, put the video memory to at least 45 yeah 46 maybe fine you split up to 46 and go storage now without you doing this step, it won't work. So you have to click this button right here. Um, choose a disk. Look for your ISO. Basically, have a new desktop, so <clears throat> should be right here. I'll come in this folder. By the way, I used to get out. Click open. This will be a disk above empty. Don't delete empty. Just don't. Then click OK. Now this will change. Just like that, and press start. Now this virtual box is gonna come out. Now I have this. All I have to do is click enter, and you just wait thirty seconds. And yeah, for thirty seconds. I'll pause the video and be back. All right, guys, I'm back. Now it's running. Yes, uh, leave it a while. I'll come back to this. I had a glitch after that it stayed like this for like hours. I don't know why. And I had to, because I was messing around with the preferences, because I couldn't find the, the memory. That's when I got the error about saying the memory isn't working. So this should go away after a couple of minutes. Like this, and it'll have this back again. You can see a root something in the bottom here. 
and I should have a flashing thing, whatever that is. Um, I have to press the start and X. Make sure you have the X after the start and then continue, and it will turn black. And you have back chapter 5 with an R3. Remember, this does work with any version. Now, this R will come up. And you got applications and stuff like that. Now you have this button, which you will need to install. Wait till it opens up. Uh. Put your language and then you skip forward. Obviously, I speak English, so they'll set up a clock. Um, no, I'm actually pick your region. If it picks the incorrect one, just change it. Um, forward, I guess you change it right here or just here. <laughs> okay, so it'll say guess your opinion, and I guess if it doesn't even change it, I guess. And you can just test it if it does work. I think if you I think this is for like if you put Chinese or something it will put the actual how it looks like. Like it won't be the same. But you can just case your own and just use your own, I guess. It said there's no computer, the computer has no operating system in it. Don't worry about that. Just erase and use the entire disk and click forward. Now, I'll just wait till I get there. See, this is the part. If you do get an error saying, <clears throat> saying that you can't, like, you will still install it. Like, I think it's right here. It will say if you, did, if you didn't put it enough, the right amount of, GB on it, it will say right here somewhere that you could still install it, but you may get an error saying it's not enough space, and you will get that error while it's downloading, and you will probably get really mad once <laughs> it's downloading. You wait like minutes, and it's installing the system. So this does take a while loading. So I'll cut the video and be back once it's done. Peace. Oh, and by the way, you just want to tell you right now, kind of, um, you could actually put above. You actually put more than thirty GB. <laughs> so yeah, you don't have to put exactly thirty point seventy two. You just can't put it lower than that. So yeah, I just want to tell you that quick. That was meant. But yeah. Finally, after 480 hours of waiting, finally reached 50. Oh god, 480 hours to go. Oh, well, at least it's going faster. I don't want to wait 480 hours. No. Fuck! See Slendy, Slender, what the fuck are you doing here? No, no, no! What the fuck? Now you're confirming the fucking target system. Just fucking hurry up, you masturbating or something? Yes. See, it listens to me. Yeah, like this way. <laughs> In that movie, it's a bitch. So a bitch. Oh god! Oh god! My lady must step to bed. It is two ninety three. What the fuck? I am not happy. You are a bitch, computer. I'm having illusions. My mirror, it's moving. To the right. It's really weird. I haven't seven. And over 900 fucking days! Yeah! It's shit. It's still a 93%. Gah! I fucking
fucking hate this. Not really. Well, shut the fuck up. Yes, yes, move. I'm having illusions. I'm gonna go to sleep. That is today's channel has been this. You can continue on testing your vision now, but not until you show your computer any changes to make it that you say will not be preserved. Uh, yeah, I recommend you guys to restart the computer. It won't restart this computer, it'll just restart uh, this particular virtual computer. And if it does restart my computer, I will just freak out. All right. Okay, my system is going to reboot now. Yeah, it's doing all this. Things okay. If you get any error, guys, just send it to me. Hear yeah, I me mean, if you have any errors. Um, people can listen to the same media and close the tray if I need a presenter. Yes, presenter, I guess. The computer will not restart. <laughs> now, the whole thing's gonna happen again. Yeah, yeah. This is coming out. I feel like I'm in a movie when I'm hacking stuff. I'm pretty serious. How the black numbers and shit. <clears throat> so, God, if this crashes, I'm gonna break my computer. I'm serious. Yes. I guess my computer doesn't want to die. Hmm. All right. Forgot. God damn it. Okay, fine. This put your password. What the fuck? What? What the hell? <laughs> what the hell? Login. Hmm. Backtrack. Hmm. 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 That's rude, yeah. Uh, I'll be back, guys. What? Oh, I'll be back. So, yeah, I'll be back once it's yeah, working. So, okay, guys, I'm back and I found a way how to run it. Now, the problem with me was is that. This has a default password, and I've been reading online, and I finally got the default password. Now, I really don't know how to change it. You, I just know you could change it, but we don't know how. Um, I am like the the login is right up here, but I can't get my mouse because it's pretty weird. Uh, let me get. Yeah, right here. Where it says BT login, um, the little two dots root slash tour right there. The root one is the username and the tour is the password. So username you just put root and root and then password you just put tour and it should tell you that um Linux, blah, 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 Gion, Linux, sync explanation, and it should say reboot, and once you reach there, I think you press start X, and it should um, log in again. Um, I would recommend you leave it, be like default, just remember, because you never know, maybe you forget your password, and I really don't know how to... <laughs> Do that. What? What? No! I'm not gonna install this again. Oh, I think that stays there. Am I correct? Yes, it stays there. It stays there. It stays there. It stays there. Anyways, guys, um, 
if if I get enough likes and like that, like reviews and stuff, and you guys like my videos, I really don't care about likes. It's just if you guys like the way I like, teach you guys how to saw the, all this, I make another video to show you guys how to use Backtrack 5RG. Cause we won't know how to use this. It's <laughs> yeah, I, mean, I know a little bit, but yeah. Good luck, guys.